Yo dudes, it is Adrian here, back with another Minecraft map. This one is called Dimension Dropper and was made by Lego Pitstop. Uh, let's just see the Dimension Dropper rules. Try not to use Optifine, I don't have Optifine on this one. Use cheats if you're stuck. Wait, are we gonna get stuck? Nah, probably works fine. Uh, have fun. Well, I'll be having fun. Uh, hop to play, find water and drop into it. Each level has one gold ingot per point. Then find the button to move on to the next level. So what I've heard and what I've known is that it, this might be one of the shortest uh, dropper maps. But, you know, I don't mind. Uh, I've heard some people talk about it. Um, yeah, I just want to say, let's hop right into it. Three, two, one, let's drop. Level one, the overworld. Let's see, how is the world? Oh, my render distance might not be far enough. Let's put it up to 60. Okay, there we go. We can now see the end of the level. So we have some water near the house and some water down. So I'll, I guess I'll be hitting it down. Three, two, one, drop. So we're down here now. That was pretty easy though, going to the next level. Uh, each level had a gold bar, so I might be going to search for the gold bar. Anyway, let's drop, drop right down. And that's our first death. Nice. Three, two, one, go. There we go. And I saw something down here as well. That's pretty easy if I say so myself. I get a checkpoint for some parkour. Okay. There we go, another checkpoint. And we got insane speed. So. Level 3 the end already. Okay. Anyway. We'd be dropping into the water. Going to the reward room. You have completed the challenge dimension dropper. I give you the power. Your game mode has been updated to creative mode. Oh. Well, you know what to do. Actually, I don't, because I did not find the gold ingots just yet. So, I think I'm just gonna go back to the start and retry the map and press the button to play. So, here we go again. And this time in the search for gold. So as you guys can see, next to the little house is a puddle of water. I think I should be able to land in there. Okay, there is the first gold in that we need. And from here we can just hop down into here. Anyway, we got one, we just need, wait a second, can, can I see it from here? I did it with the other one, kind of curious what happens if you, okay, well anyway, I filled the second one again. Okay, so I never actually looked behind my back. And I, of course, built the most easy parkour there is. There we go, there is our second. You know what, let's just run down. Bloop. And continue our adventure. Whee! 
Just finishing the map twice, why not? Oh, well, I guess I'm not finishing it that quickly. But I screwed this one up again. Well, again, actually the first time I just failed the parkour, but that happens. There we go. Going to the third and final level, which is the end. Which I also notice is that we have two different kind of water puddles. I'm kind of curious what happens if I land into the first one. So I don't fall through. So there are probably barrier blocks. I see a dragon egg. Yeah, I moved the dragon egg. That's how we want to do it. By the way, how much experience do I have? One, two, three, four. Whoa. About a mil. Levitation. Okay, I am up in. Oh, there's a dragon head. Interesting. I want to be on top of a dragon head. Let's regen a little bit. Please. And get to the dragon head. Yeah. Woo. Me and my buddy. Just going around. He's like nom 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 nom. Okay. Enough wandering around. Let's just go up here. Is there? Yes. There's a reason for this. And the reason is gold. I guess it teleported me. Anyway, I will teleport your egg outside of the map. <laughs> Let's eat some steak. I love all of this gold. I have all of this gold. Let's go down here. To end it. So it says you completed the dimension dropper. And I'm actually kind of curious. At, uh, no, it doesn't say anything for advancement dimension dropper so that's pretty cool though i got the gold and i got the diamonds the emeralds uh, the map destroyer the beacon and everything so yeah i think uh we're gonna keep it there i uh want to say uh this is probably one of the shortest maps i've done but it was fun nonetheless Especially the team from Overworld, Nether, and and of course, that's not much you can do if you have that team. But I hope you guys enjoyed this fun Minecraft map, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye! Yeah, dudes, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment down any ideas below.